Yes. Awesome. <laughs> well, it's motor at the moment. We haven't put the sails up yet. Yeah. What is it? Four knots of wind? Four knots. It will increase to about 10 to 15. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we're just going to go for a sail. Yeah, be careful. Out in the river. We might head out towards the coast. Yeah. Yeah. We'll have a look. We'll stop for lunch. Uh, and make our way back just so we start familiarizing ourselves um, with the boat. Yeah, so should be good. And we're gonna shake down too. Yeah, should be exciting. As we make our way out of the Port River, we race the main and then later the jib. My job was to figure out how to point the boat into the wind as the boys raced the main sail. After a few goes, I finally figured out what it meant to point the boat into the wind so the boys didn't have to fight the wind as they raised the sails. Good army. Yep. It is different. We did all our checks. Yes. Set up everything ourselves. All the cupboards are locked. Yes, definitely. Vendors are up. Vendors are up. What else is there? Sail, Sail away. Should we try without the engine now? Yeah, yeah. take it back Put army. It into neutral. Put it into neutral. Because it stops the prop from rotating, so gearbox isn't working. Okay. So oh look, there's a sailboat in front. Can you see it in the distance? Yeah, and okay. they're sailing. Enrique, so you're good. Awesome. We're just now drifting. It's working. We're doing two knots. Two and a half knots. Nice work, boys. See if you can go at that angle, Rick, see if we can make it like towards the sheds. Yeah. Make sure you've got the behind. Hold it there. That's it, Mike. Okay. 1.9 knots. <laughs> yeah, because we lost a bit and now it's gaining. Because, well, it's a lot of it was from the engine. Uh, a bit off here. Keep Back motoring out a little bit. You got it neutral, please, sweetheart. All right, neutral. One and a half knots. There we go. What are you doing, hun? I was just checking if any water got in. Okay. So, there's a little bit of water in there. It's a very, very little bit in there, but it's um, that's just from the stuffing box. So, which is good because I want. I don't know if you heard me in there because the engine, but I was just checking for water. Yep. There was a little bit of water, not much, nothing to worry about. But it's just from the stuffing box? The stuffing box, which I tightened on the way out, so that was, could have been from um, the other day. Alright, so you just keep an eye on it? Yeah, because you don't want to tighten the stuffing box too much because then no water gets in. Yeah. And then it burns up, heats up, and all the. So you want, you want water to get in, but you don't want it to be dripping, if yeah. that makes sense. All right, cool. Okay, we are 
put our life jackets on because um, we're about to head out of the channel and into the coastal waters. Should be fun. Looking forward to it? Yep, should be good. We've got autopilot. Yeah, autopilot. Autopilot. <laughs> Still not enough wind though. Still we don't have enough wind to sail so we'll just motor out there. Once we clear everything then we'll turn off the engine and try to find some wind. Yeah. We're, yeah. Not, we're not after speed anyway so we'll just we'll try to get a sailing. Get well, away. We're, just, we're just leading the rope for the moment. Yeah, yeah. we just get away from the markers and poles and stuff. There we go. I mean the sails look full now but as soon as you stop it dies so it could be because we're running out. 4.5 knots. Yeah. 5.4. 5.4, sorry. So it sounds like you're doing something now. This is our first sail. Anything's better than nothing. Yeah, we got a bit of speed. <laughs> we could try to do a tack and go out. So That's... if we're going in this direction, a tack would be that direction maybe? Go out that way? We'll see. Well, a tack we'll see would be feels... that way. We don't need to do it right now. We've got to eat first. Yeah, right. All right, let's eat. We've got no, a dolphin we... and we just missed a seal that jumped up. Didn't expect to see a seal. No, I've never seen a seal. Wow. That was awesome. Missed it on the camera. Bugger. <laughs> Wanna do a tack? Or oh, let's eat. No, let's finish eating this. How lazy are we at sailors? <laughs> Yeah, we're going back where we came from. No, we're going out. Hold on. Are we going 
come back anyway? It's three o'clock. Yeah, we're going to go out and to go back in, but I can't. Look, we cut the thing. We've got to go over there. So we, we cut straight out there. And then, can you make that go straight out? No, I'm taking straight the out. It's oh, cold. Wind. Yeah. Doing 2.2 .2 knots at the moment. Yeah, the winds, the wind sort of died there, didn't it? No, it actually is dying down now. Feel it. Just as I start talking about the speeds. We did have a 3.7. That was pretty cool. Yeah, that's alright. I lost it two seconds ago. It's gone that way too yeah. much. But the winds died and sort of changed on us. If we were to get out more, we'd have to tack again and go. Yeah, but the wind right now is coming. We finally got to sail our boat. After two years of restoration work, we got to enjoy our very first sail on our own and it was fantastic. We still have a lot of learning to do, but considering this is our first ever sail on our own, we're pretty pleased with it. We partly sailed and partly traveled under engine, clocking a total of approximately 15 nautical miles. Not too bad, hey? Well, we look forward to continuing to refit our boat and learning how to sail. So until next time.